Hello there and welcome to Linux Studio and in this video I'm going to show you how you can install Unity desktop in your Ubuntu. So for those who don't know what is Unity, Unity was the default and the official desktop environment for Ubuntu for years. But with the release of 18.04, they decided to drop it out in favor of GNOME desktop environment. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install it in your Ubuntu and start using it. This can be because you want to live that nostalgia again or you are someone who just like to try new stuff. And if you're wondering what this desktop environment is, this is Deepin. And if you want to know how to install it in your Ubuntu, then watch out this video. This will show you how you can install Deepin desktop environment in your Ubuntu. So without further ado, let's get started with the installation on how to install Unity in your Ubuntu. So what you want to do is just open up the terminal and update your repository. So for that, you can issue sudo apt update. Type in your password and this should update the repos for the latest packages. So after that, just clear the terminal and uh, install the Ubuntu Unity desktop package from the repository. For that, just type sudo apt install Ubuntu and hit enter. So this will download around 100 megabytes of the packages that are required to run the Unity. So just hit enter again and this will do that. So the installation has completed now, but I would like to point out one thing and that is because I have already switched to the light DM desktop manager. So I am not getting any option to switch from ZDM3 to light DM. But when you will install it for the first time, you will get that option to switch from. And if you do not get, then you can get it using this command. And you will see a window like this you just have to hit enter and switch light DM here because if you want to have a login screen look like the unity then you have to select this option and if you just want to have a previous like gnome login screen then you can switch to ZDM3 that is gnome desktop manager so make sure you select this one if you want unity style login so now what you have to do you just have to restart your system or your virtual machine in my case 